Well, happening today, La Vaita is getting ready for the second day of Oktoberfest. It's the area's first time hosting a three-day event where you can celebrate, celebrate all things German. It also comes with the Beer Garden River Walk reopening after downtown construction. So it's a pretty big deal. Ken's Five's Earl Sotomayor is there this morning. He's been there throughout the morning, showing us a lot of different things that are so fun. Earl, what's happening right now? Top of the day, Sarah. It is five o'clock somewhere, and that somewhere is right here at La Vita. And we have a ton of food right here. Just a little taste of what you can expect at this year's Oktoberfest. So I want to bring in the expert. You guys are putting it together. Aaron Selenkoff, Mad Dog's Restaurant Group. So what do we have right now? Of course, thanks for having us. We're super excited about today. This is a couple of uh, different German uh, specialties that we're going to be having at the Oktoberfest at La Vita. We have some great uh, pretzels with beer cheese, Schinerbach beer cheese, and some grainy German mustard. We have a sausage on a stick. We have some sauerkraut there. We also have our bratwurst on a pretzel bun with some sauerkraut and some cabbage and potato salad. These are some different uh, things that might be available today at the at the beer garden here at Oktoberfest. All right, Aaron. So I'm, I'm gonna have to try this bratwurst. Yeah. But you know, as I take a nibble of this, can you just tell me about what can people experience if they're just sitting here enjoying some good food? So if you're sitting at the beer garden having a couple of cold uh, liters of beer, there's going to be some great entertainment. There's some German bands, some other bands. There's also some dance groups and cloggers in town uh, doing some different demonstrations. Um, as well, this is a, this, it's always important to tell you this is a totally free event for the entire public to come out and enjoy. The kids are welcome as well. There's a kid, uh, we call it kinder garden. Well. We've got lots of different games for the kids out here today and some foods for the kids like, of course, cotton candy and, and different things like that for the kids. Uh, in addition to our great food, there's also some different vendors from different people on the Riverwalk coming down, like Paisano's actually has come down. They're gonna have a veal schnitzel on a stick and some other great vendors as well, too. Uh, as well, there's some cooking demonstrations and a wine garden here. Remember, open to the public, free and awesome food, entertainment, and fun. All right, well, you gave us a whole spiel, and thank you for that. I'm gonna go ahead and try this bratwurst. Let's see. Let's see what we cook it with. I'm gonna grab a pretzel. All right. Can we can we do like a bread cheer? You know. There we go. Cheers, my cheers. man. All right. Great. Okay. This is good. Awesome. Thank you so much. You go. <laughs> oh man, this one. This is the size of my head. Like this is kind of crazy. Earl. But this and many other food items here at La Vida. I'm taking this back with me, so we can kind of share this back at the station. But for anyone else, please come get you one of these giant pretzels. Get you a ginormous bratwurst. We have cucumbers, you know. It's just a lot happening right now <laughs> and throughout the day. So definitely come out here. It's happening today. It's going on tomorrow for the culture. Okay. All things fun, San Antonio. Sounds and Sarah, good. I'm gonna go ahead and turn it back to you. I gotta protect the food from the flies. Yeah, get out of here. I don't want to see that food. I'm so hungry. All they gave me this month was was this mug, but has no coffee in it. So I'm really hungry. Thank you, Earl. We look forward to more of your reporting later on today.